you for coming to us today. Yes. So can you please tell us your name and your background details a bit? Sure. My name is Param Shroff. I'm the uh, chairman of uh, IBC Group. And we are a small uh, private equity fund uh, with a focus on uh, crypto. Um, and we invest in uh, mainly uh, uh, early stage uh, companies, uh, mid-level companies and during ICOs last year. Um, we sort of lost our shirt now because uh, all crypto is down 80-90% including Bitcoin down from its top. But I think uh, the underlying technology blockchain has a lot of promise and that's one of the reasons uh, um, I'm still uh, an investor uh, in uh, the blockchain space. So what do you plan to get out of this event today? Well, uh, you know, one of the best uh, events I've visited in my life are blockchain events is because of the enthusiasm that exists uh, in uh, in at these blockchain events, I mean the type of buzz and the type of motivation and enthusiasm, in uh, and the type of passion in uh, people's uh, minds and uh, hearts uh, for their uh, specific project is so uh, mesmerizing and so contagious to see. You know, and uh, there's some great projects here uh, today that were pitched to us, and uh, uh, we will, uh, you know, uh, carry on conversations uh, with them and uh, look to uh, possibly see if uh, uh, any of them meet our investment criteria. So how prominent do you think the blockchain technology be to uh, probably stretch the social fabric globally? I think that's very important. You know, I was attended a conference or a meeting uh, in uh, Toronto and uh, I was put in front of all these youth. And it's so interesting to see, you know, uh, kids who are, you know, 12 or 14 years old how easily acceptable they are with cryptocurrencies comparatively to uh, to uh, our age uh, guys um, in their 30s and 40s. So it's it's even below us in terms of these kids are utilizing it. And um, and even if you, I visited China uh, uh, lastly, and uh, I was in the, the cab, and the guys asked me, "Do you have any uh, Bitcoin or Ethereum?" or any cryptocurrency. I'm like, don't you want cash or don't you want a credit card? He's like, no, no, if you have some, please give to me. I'm like, yeah, sure, I'll give you uh, that. So I'm like, how will you accept it? He's like, oh, scan this. It's like, wow, you know, you know exactly how to accept uh, crypto in China, where supposedly it's illegal. And he's like, I said, why are you gonna, what are you going to do with the crypto? He's like, uh, sir, I move it overseas. I can move it uh, uh, internationally. So then I realized, wow, so he's trying to get a little bit of Bitcoin or any cryptocurrency to be able to use it between countries or to his family overseas. So it is really, it's very unique in terms of how digital payment transfers or digital hold of value can create positive impact for society and of course negative too. And how did the networking sessions go today? I hope you met some interesting people out there. Yes, we met some very interesting people, some from the United States, uh, Silicon Valley, some from Abu Dhabi, some from Belgium, some from Africa. And um, um, the guys, the organizers have done a great job uh, and uh, wish them well. And uh, I really uh, enjoyed meeting uh, the, uh, the entire team behind um, uh, Global Blockchain uh, uh, Foundation. And um, I wish you guys all the best and look forward to attending more of the events. Okay. Thank you for that. And uh, lastly, what do you think uh, Global Blockchain Foundation can do to the blockchain ecosystem? I think it really is, you know, the people behind it and I, the type of team and the type of organizational skills that Global Blockchain uh, Foundation has, I think they're very poised to uh, be uh, 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 a great platform, uh, at least in this part of uh, uh, Asian region. Um, where uh, a lot of education, a lot of you know um, mentoring, a lot of inter-company um, discussions and different inter-industry discussions should be taking place, or with different technologies should be being discussed. And uh, who uh, you know in the Asia, they are very hardworking in terms of they're very abreast with uh, 
um, all the upcoming new technologies because they're very hungry. And uh, I think this uh, Global Blockchain Foundation uh, Forum uh, and the Foundation Forum that the platform that is being created, I think it will um, make a huge impact uh, for the blockchain space in uh, this region. Okay. Thanks a lot for your time. Thank you. And thank you for making this event a success. Thank you.